Hey, so here we are in the arcade. Everything's powered up. It's so cool in here. I love it. I love a good arcade. Navy Station is a great one. We're gonna take a little kind of like a walk through here. I want to show you guys like all the really cool things that are to see in this arcade. Here, let's let's start over here. We've got kind of like a bit of like a like a retro retro arcade alley over here. This is where they keep all the classic games. So like those games you always see on like those like classic collections that you probably played here computer back in like computer class. These those kind of games. We've got the classics. We've got Defender, Miss Pac-Man, Galaga. I love Galaga. Galaga's a personal favorite of mine. Burger Time, Donkey Kong. Here, come on. I'm going to play a little bit of Galaga action. Let's take a look at this. Let's see if I can get the high score. I haven't played in a while, so let's see if I still have uh, still have the skills to do it from them. If I, or if I'm feeling a little rusty. See, the trick is... You gotta be where the ships are gonna be. You gotta let yourself get caught. I'm in. It's it's really been a while since I played it, so like I'm a, I'm a little rusty, but I think I can get this going. Let's even get my ship caught. Get a second now ago. Wait, hold on, hold on. Nope. Ah. Just, just warm it up. That's all it is. Just warm it up. It's a warm up match. I want to see if we can get at least one down with them before we get out of here. You gotta, you gotta turn these butt guys blue. All right, perfect. Set it up. Uh, I can do this. Last ship. Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, so I got captured. It looks like I have a treble, but this is what you want to do in Galaga. Now I gotta go rescue this guy. But I gotta wait till he flies back down. It's my last guy, I can do it. Got him! I got it, look at it, I got two Galagas. Look at me, I'm the Galaga King, I'm doing it. All right, here's your really good clean up. the high score. I didn't get it, but I got I got my Galga. And I have a hit miss ratio at 55%. I think that's that's really respectable. But yeah, that's Galaga. I love Galaga. I'm so happy they have a cabinet here. Here, we can uh, keep taking a look at some of these other machines down here. Let's see. Uh, well, looks like Robotron's not working at the moment, which is okay. Robot Uprising will not be televised today. Uh, Donkey Kong? I don't think we have it here right now. But we actually have a special version of Donkey Kong called Yeti Kong. It's a special mod where Donkey Kong's replaced the Yeti, and you gotta collect T-shirts. It rules. I, I think it might be on a, it might be on tour at the moment, but I'm sure it'll be back in here in a while. We've got a lot of games that we like swap in and out of the arcade. But right next to Donkey Kong, we have Donkey Kong Three with Stanley, Stanley the Bug Man. You guys remember this guy? You got Mario, Luigi, Wario, Waluigi, and Stanley. Never forget Stanley. Classic Frogger, as seen on Seinfeld. Space Invaders. I don't know if you can see this in here. It's the kind of Space Invaders too, where um, there's a special background. If you can see it inside, there's actually a screen down here that gets that gets reflected up onto the background here. So this game's actually in full black and white. They didn't have any color, but by reflecting it up on the screen like this, it looks like it's in full color on the surface of the moon. It's really, really, really cool. You can really kind of see the ingenuity at work here. You can even tell how old this is, because like, no joysticks, it's just these buttons to move back and forth. Like, it's really, really old school like this. This is, like I said, this is old school alley. If you're the kind of person that loves to play like these old games from the 80s and the 70s and stuff, this is your first stop in the Eddie Station. I know for me, I probably will always be stopping at that Galaga machine to get a few points. Um, let's take a bit more of a look here. Oh, this is really cool. Look at this, look at this. We've got Cubert, and it's actually signed by the grader of Cubert. It's even signed in little, like, gobbledygook. So, like, where else can you find this signature, literally signature copy of Cubert? It's incredible. I love this little guy. I love doing Wreck-It Ralph. Ooh, ooh. 
Ooh, this is this is the part I'm excited about. Come here. I want to show you guys this. This rules. This rules. These are the pinball tables. I love pinball. We've opened up some really cool tables here. Um, look here, we've got Super Mario Brothers. Uh, this guy is kind of a little hard to find this day and age. I don't necessarily know if it's exactly like a rare table, but this is a table that a lot of people tend to want to collect because of the novelty of having a Super Mario pinball table. It's not often you get a chance to see something like this, especially since, you know, Nintendo's not in the business of making pinball tables, but instead, Gottlieb is with the Gottlieb Classic. Here, come take a, come take a closer look at it. Really neat because, like, a lot of Mario merch you tend to see tends to be focused on a Mario 2 and sometimes Mario 3. This guy, we've got a lot of Mario World, so this game is like, what year is this? This is 1992, so this is one year after Super Nintendo was out. So, like, we've got all the Mario World trimmings. We've got, well, of course, we've got Bowser, Luigi, Mario. Surprisingly, no Peach. I don't really stand for this Peach erasure, but we got some Yoshis. Yeah, another Yoshi. We got secret keys. Oh, that rules. I love this. Ah. Consolation prize, come on. Oh, I gotta choose. Um, uh, 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 ah, jeez. Okay, mega bumpers, let's go. I got overwhelmed. Oh, I can hear Peach. She's in here somewhere. I gotta rescue her. I will find you, princess. Don't worry. The bumpers, Mario, the bumpers. I hear you, Princess. I'm working on it. Oh, uh, just hearing the machine make all these Mario sounds is really cool. Sometimes, sometimes you win them, sometimes you don't. This is really weird though, right? Because I, I want to say this game predates the first appearance of Charles Martinet as Mario, but the Mario in this game absolutely sounds like the high-pitched like Italian Charles Martinet, so I have no idea what's going on here. Maybe this machine predicted the future, but there's loads of other cool pinball machines here. Um, I like this one. This is pretty cool. Part the Party Zone. If you look at it, if you know your pinball, you've got, you've got Dr. Dude, You've got the party dudes, you've got Elvira's party monsters, and these party animals from Hot the Cottage. This is like the Smash Brothers of pinball tables. We have all these pinball stars just on this table, but it's, it's still pretty cool because it's just covered in all sorts of uh, gadgets and gizmos. That's what you like to see. Rockets, ramps, uh, doctors, everything a pinball table needs. And of course, we got some uh, newer tables over here too. Uh, we've got Star Wars, Deadpool. Kids love Deadpool. They got they gotta get their Deadpool. But if you love pinball, this is also the first place you want to come. Again, it just feels like this half of the arcade is just the perfect retro corner. We've got the oldest games. We've got the coolest pinball tables. It's pretty rad. All right, let's go and take a look at the rest of the arcade. All right, we gotta stop for a second and take a look at this one. This one looks really cool. Fisherman's Bait. Now, I like a good fishing game. I'm no stranger to a good fishing game because I love uh, Sega Bass Fishing. I love how that game kind of starts out like a normal fishing game and eventually it just kind of becomes Dark Souls. We're in a castle when you have to attack a knight and find secret openings and stuff. So I'm really kind of curious to see if this game does the same sort of thing. Let's give it a try. 
You know what? Let's go all in. All fish challenge. Alright, going to Venus Bay. I really should have seen that. This is actually the Sega 32X version of Doom. 
Let's see what this kind of looks like. Let's see, where am I at? Not too young to die. Hey, not too right. You're the play. You know what? Let's go for it. Mistakes were made. Uh, let's, let's move on. Let's see what else we have going on in the arcade. Oh, it's Super Street Fighter 2, the new challengers in this massive arcade. But it's not just any version of this game. It's an anniversary edition, so you can actually pick any character from any of the versions of the games. We're going with uh, Red Ryu. I'm a little rusty on this. <laughs> okay, a well-placed kick to my face. Way to go, me. Uh, let's see what else we have going on in the arcade. There's still so many more games in here. We're barely scratching the surface. Let's take a look over here. Space Harrier. I love Space Harrier. I love this one. I love this elephant dude. I love everything about this game. Now, it's not like the big cabinet that like moves you around, but this guy's still pretty cool too. It's stand up. You got the throttle. Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Hold on, I got this. Aha! Oh, we put a well stick on this one. Oh, I can shoot the rocks, okay. I can shoot everything. This game's fun, it's like a 3D shmup. It's actually a really good version of this on a 3DS. You can play it in 3D, it looks incredible. Yeah, I got this, I haven't even got this, didn't scratch on me. Oh, I got a scratch on me. But it's dragon time, baby. Dragon's weird, you gotta shoot him in the face. So you can't just like get him and going away, you have to face it head off. Got him! Got me! Oh wow, there's like at least like four firing buttons on this thing. Oh okay, you can go even faster if you use a separate button. Interesting. A whole new level of strategy I never expected from this game. Okay, now I'm unstoppable. I keep saying that. Every time I say I'm not touched, that's when I get hit. I need, stop. I need to watch out for my hubris, which I'll be my own undoing. I gotta keep my eyes on the road, too. Woo. Okay, I, I think I kind of reached my uh, limit for how much of this game I can handle. It's getting... Look, it looks really easy, but trust me, this game gets really challenging as it goes on. There's just broccoli everywhere. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Get a little, get a little worn out here. I still got... Many, many lives to go, so we're gonna we're just gonna let this one play out and we're gonna take it toward the arcade, so don't tell anybody. Class. near and dear to my heart. 
NBA, NBA Jam, NBA Jam. This game rules. I know what you're thinking. Basketball, basketball. But y'all, if you've not played NBA Jam, it's one of the greatest. Have you ever played an NBA, have you ever played a basketball game where you can be the Fresh Prince in TJ Jazzy Jeff and see flaming folks from across the court? No, you haven't. That's what NBA Jam rules. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna play a little bit because I love, 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 love this game. I wish I remembered some of the cheat codes. Now, I'm personally a fan of the New York Knicks. I always get good performance from the Knicks. Alright, the match is starting out. Things are gonna get heated. Got your big heads on. You gotta have big heads. Now it ain't the same. We're not playing with the human being, but it's still a lot of fun.
Konami game. This is a this is after all a Konami joint. Oh, let's go.
All right, I still got it. I thought it was maybe a little rusty, but I still got it in Street Fighter 3 at least. It's such a fun game. I, I love it. It just feels so good. It looks so good. It sounds great. It's a great time all around. Give me one more match. Let's see if I can take on old Thunder Thighs herself, Chun Li. Let's see. decides it for all the marbles. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> he was wait, right. yep. wait, wait, there are three there are Space three. Cadet tables and I've only ever seen one of them? Are you serious? So wait. Ooh. Flax. <laughs> I won! <laughs> <laughs>